brought to you by Abercrombie Gemmell, chartered accountants at the hub of business. The Glasgow Hawks Sports Trust is delighted to sponsor the Scottish Hydro Premier One Hawks versus West match. Tonight we're at Old Annesland for the Scottish Hydro Premier One clash between West of Scotland, who come down from just up the road there to take on Glasgow Hawks here on their home patch. It's Friday night, it's Glasgow, it's a derby. I tell you what, this could be a real tasty one tonight. And for West, it's a very, very important game. Only one point from three starts. And they'll be looking to get on the board tonight, but it's a very, very difficult task ahead of them against a hot side who are sitting in fourth place on the table, moving well from the start of the season. Peter Wright's got them really going with a good blend of experience and young, quick, pacey players. This is a team to be reckoned with. Hawks kicking off Duncan Weir, popping it down towards the West 22, taken there, but straight away, referee Gary Gordon sees an offence, bit of obstruction. Penalty, Hawks. We'll have a bit of that, says Captain Nick Cox, and up step Duncan Weir. Straight over. Exactly the start Hawks wanted and the one that West dreaded. The visitors came back though in 10 minutes. Lovely ball to Richard Douglas, finding the gap and there was no stopping the big West centre. What a try! After only 10 minutes and West ahead, five points to three. And that one, well, bound to give them loads of confidence the way Douglas opened up the defence there. Good run out of defence there by Craig Gossman. On to Graham Harkness, knocked over. West looking for the turnover. Are they a wee bit overzealous? Yes. Gary Gordon deciding no advantage. Penalty to Hawks. And again, Duncan Weir, no problem. 42 metres out, mind you, but straight in front. And straight over, 6-5, after 13 minutes. Approaching the half hour, and West giving as good as they were getting, and oh my goodness, Grant Strangle of nightmares when he sees that one again. Connor Davis won. The young standoff intercepting, going over for the try, and although he missed a kick, that took West into a 10 points to 6 lead. Tails up now, and Weir kick down fuel, well taken by Michael Sim. Running back at Hawks, lovely wee chip ahead, beautiful bounce, and right on his shoulder, Richard Dalgleish, nobody was going to stop him from there, in under the post for his second try of the half, and West stretching away, and I tell you what, this wasn't in the script. Delighted West players there, even more delighted. Connor Davis slotting the conversion and the home support stunned as West go into half time 17 6 ahead. Scrum Magazine. Subscribe online at scrummagazine.com. Brought to you by Abercrombie Gemmell, chartered accountants at the hub of business. The Glasgow Hawks Sports Trust is delighted to sponsor the Scottish Hydro Premier One Hawks versus West match. Into the second half and West still keeping up the pressure. Out there to Conor Davis, not quite getting away from the tacklers, but good support from the West back row. David Young to Andy Park and Graham Fiskin, the number eight. Back to Andy Park, an inside ball to Elliot McLaren, a lot to do. We dummy, we shimmy, but not held by the defence and over the line. Was it a try? You better believe it. And Hawk could protest all he wanted, but McLaren was over the line before his foot was in touch. Now it was time for Hawks to head back. They certainly had to do something. Number eight, Grant Strang, knocked back there by Andy Park's tackle. Hawks beginning to work a lot harder realising they had to do something to get back in the game and the man to do it for them was Duncan Weir one wee shimmy, two wee shimmies but he can't get away from that lot surely he certainly did what a try by the number 10 
Yeah, you can see he enjoyed that one. And West looking just a wee bit embarrassed that they couldn't stop him with all those men in defence. Here, converting his own try. And at 13.22 with 26 minutes to go, it was all to play for. Hawks really coming back into the game now. Rory Mackay knocked over, but the ball whipped out to Weir. Joe Stafford on the charge. We knock on there. And then interception by Sean Murray. But now, bring it back, boys, says Gary Gordon. No advantage to West. Ten minutes later, though, scrum to Hawks in exactly the same position, and this time they really turned the screw. Big drive on. Grant Strang at the back, controlling things. Number nine, Peter Jarasevich. Telling the forwards where he wants them to go. But in the end, it didn't matter. Penalty try for that huge pressure that they put on the West Pack. Conversion for Weir. Right in front of the posts. Drop kick to keep play going. Well, wanted to make most of the time left, but West... They took advantage of the time they had left. A lot of pressure on the Hawk line, getting up to the five-meter line. Gordon Bullock busting through there, but just dropping the ball before he got over the line. And the kick charged down by David Young didn't matter. What did matter, though, deep into injury time, was a penalty to Hawks on the halfway line, which was almost certainly going to be the last kick of the game, and this one to win it by Duncan Weir. It was high, it was long, but it wasn't quite long enough. And taken by West, trying to get out of danger, over their own line, touchdown. And yep, that was the final play. And you can see how much it meant to their supporters and how much it meant to the team. You know, we came here last year, Again, fantastic crowd and we went away the losers and we were determined not to let that happen to us again so you know we worked really hard in the build up to this Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and you know what it means to the guys there you know they saw, saw the reaction after we, we won that game and uh, you couldn't win it in any better circumstances with them just missing the kick at the end to win it so uh, yeah ecstatic it'll be a good night So the West League campaign kicks in with a memorable win at Old Annesland Hawks well they'll have to crank it up next week for their game down at Millbrae against Ayr but it's been a great night in Glasgow. A terrific derby between Hawks and West. This is Ron Evans for Scottish Rugby Television at Old Annesland. Brought to you by Abercrombie Gemmell, Chartered Accountants, at the hub of business. The Glasgow Hawks Sports Trust is delighted to sponsor the Scottish Hydro Premier One Hawks vs West match.